Hi there. Good day. This is uh, Captain Bjorn Fernandez once again. And for today's vlog, I'm going to teach you the basics of uh, the automatic identification system, which is our uh, local model or the ship's model right now is the Kelvin Use. Okay, Kelvin Use AIS GPS or the Global Positioning System. Okay, so basically, if you press mode right here. It will show you the four tabs. We have the navigate, the plan voyage, the alarms and messages, and then the config. Okay, so one by one, I'm going to show you what's uh, inside these four tabs. And apart from that, I'm going to teach you on how to send an AIS message. It's a text message, also by uh, by channel A and B, and also by long range, and also. You can also send message by just broadcasting. So apart from entering the maritime mobile service identity of that uh, ship's station or vessel, then you may be able to also send it by a broadcast, meaning all the ships around you can receive those messages. Okay, so let's start Okay, on navigate. It will show you the target list, the plot, and the own ship data. So for target list, of course, uh, those are your your uh, target vessels, and these are their MMSIs. Okay, uh, nearest okay. vessel okay. right now okay. is Galisas. So it's the range is 0.61 and bearing it's 140 degrees through okay so going back just press escape and then with the own ship data it will show you your own vessels data such as your call sign maritime mobile service identity the latitude and then the longitude and the navigational status okay and of course your course over ground the speed over ground the heading and then the rot press next and you will see again the destination your eta and your present draft press next once again it will also show your imo number the type of your vessel tanker cargo it's uh, no information is indicated and the dim settings press show next again it goes back to the page one of your vessel static data okay so that is for the navigate tab press skip once again and then press mode on the press mode uh, plan voyage tab when you press this it will show your voyage data or your AIS dynamic data so dynamic data its navigational status we are at anchor right now destination is a uh, Mozambique Bera and the UNLO code is Mike Zulu Bravo Echo Whiskey ETA is there persons on board how many the draft or the uh, deepest draft cargo is it on one watt mode etc scroll down and that's it okay it's not in one watt mode when you go alongside you can uh, press it one watt mode so it is safe so for example you want to change how many persons aboard let's say 23 just press 23 then enter then apply exit okay and then again on the third tab press mode once again uh, this time I'm going to show you first the config the last one and then the last one will be the alarms and messages so for config it will show you the time settings the display configuration AIS configuration alarm configuration units configuration okay so basically for configuration it is the settings okay it is the AIS settings and this uh, uh, buttons this is the power button on and off this is the MOB button okay or the man overboard button if you see a man overboard then you can just press this and uh, latitude and longitude on that certain position will be marked okay and also it will appear on your act this and this is the dim okay meaning you can either use it at day or at night time so let me show you 
press that day so switch to night all right now it's in night mode going back to day again switch to day okay so that's it for configuration now go back press mode once again the last one that i will teach you is the alarms and messages okay for the alarms and messages if you click that you will see the sub tabs alarm list status list AIS messages and then the long range for the alarm alarms list okay whatever alarms that you have encountered it will be recorded there okay meaning you can even see your alarm lag all right for example no valid the rate of turn information last action it was smart 7 heading loss Okay, no valid scores over ground information. Okay, so you can even clear lag with that. Okay, for now, let's not do anything. And we go to sub menu status, status list. Okay, for the status list, uh, it's, it indicates all the status of that certain alarm. Okay, for example, no correction received, and these are the dates. Okay, and the latest one is. Yeah, March. Okay. Semaphore mode. Okay. And third sub menu is the AIS messages and then the long range. Okay. The one that uh, we are focused to do on this blog is the sending of AIS messages. Okay. For the AIS messages, click and then send text message okay now you can see their broadcast okay it can be a broadcast and you can write here your messages and you can see your channels it's either a or b or a and b so let's say for example test let's type our message then for this time, let's not try broadcast, let's try address, meaning uh, we have to input the maritime mobile service identity. So nearest vessel is this one, it automatically chooses, okay? Okay, so that's the nearest vessel. For the channel, let's try A and B, okay? Or auto, you can even choose auto. And then after that, test. You can add more uh, please acknowledge okay it's as simply as uh, texting okay on the QWERTY mode so even on board ship you can do, do this as texting other vessels okay and then just simply press send okay okay so once you press it it will show you this uh, window now go to send to verify if it's already sent okay 16 april 1103 so that is the present time right now so from he she has just received it okay there's the status receive okay so that's how you do it for the uh, sending message uh, address okay now let's go to the next topic sending message broadcast okay so it's already chosen or automatically or in default as broadcast okay so since it's broadcast the mmsi is left blank meaning it will be sent to all ships okay so broadcast and uh, this time we'll choose a plus b okay so it's all set then press send okay again that window appears you have to choose the send sub window to verify if it's sent there you go it is BR meaning it is broadcast okay receiver it is sent to all the ships nearby 
So that's how you do it. That's how you send message. Thank you very much for watching. Again, please like, subscribe, and follow or even unlike my blogs. Thank you. Have a good day.